this this is an interesting tool path. We're cutting the O-ring groove. And if you look at it, it has figured out that it wants to make this whole path a helical. So it's coming and ramping down into the material. That's in the pocketing. Uh, this is a very small end mill, so we take it easy. And all we've done, again, we're in a 2D pocket. So it allows us to choose the uh, boundaries that we need. So machining boundary is the selection. We've chosen these two chains and the height is just to the bottom of that O-ring groove. Uh, nothing much there, direction, climb, milling, flat area detection. So it knows at the bottom to, uh, to clean it up and it takes its time but it does a nice job. So if we look at the stimulation, it's going to take three minutes to do that. Could we speed it up? Yes, but we got to be reasonably ginger careful with that tiny little end mill. 